Here we are at um, 46 Morris Street in Palmerston North, scene of a uh, recent fire involving a old villa occupied by students and we're going to run through a few things to um, indicate uh, some fire safety messages and um, perhaps as it's a common style of living here in Palmerston North City we, uh, we can get a message across to other students. And whilst you don't wish a home fire on anybody it's, it's good to be able to educate the, the community as to uh, what's happened. It's probably the biggest response we've had this year. It seems to have been a, a resounding success. We've had over 300 people through and um, in an area of a lot of old homes uh, where people can see the damage caused by fire to an older home, it's, uh, yeah, it's very valuable. We can see the, the fire damage in the in the bedrooms and the hallways and we get to a bedroom where the door was closed um, the remnants of the door are there um, we can see smoke damage and some heat damage but no actual burning in the room so once again that reinforces the value of closing doors to prevent the spread of fire we can see a door that's been burnt on the top half smoke and heat stained on the on the bottom third and then the the clear bottom at portion of the door which reinforces the get down and get low in smoky conditions. Um, a number of the people coming through here today marvelled at the fact in a burnt out house there was still 300 mils of clean space at the bottom of, of there the, which would enable them to escape in a, in a smoke filled house. Even though the kitchen is at the back of the back of the house, well away from the point of origin, there's again severe fire damage in the room. Um, electronics like the microwave control panels and things are just a blob of plastic on the floor. We estimate the total fire spread from front to back of the house was in something as little as six to eight minutes. Very intense, very hot fire.